This, in fact, is one of the areas where the nursing homes and senior centers are being evacuated as we speak. Also this morning, the mayor is contemplating shutting down the entire New York City subway system. Hanging over all of this is a big question. Can this enormous city handle this enormous storm? As one observer has noted, we in New York City like to think that we're at the center of the universe. But when it comes to hurricanes, we're really on the fringes, with only five of them since 1851. It's been a long time since we've witnessed scenes like this, which makes scenes like this, stores closed up on the boardwalk, people stocking up on supplies, very strange. It's coming out and making sure I'm ready. Who knows what's coming? Experts are confident all of our skyscrapers can weather this storm, but it's all of the city's low-lying, flood-prone areas, all 17 of them, that have people worried. So how bad can it get? One of the areas, as we mentioned, is Battery Park City, where in a worst-case scenario, they could see five feet of flooding throughout this whole area. They could also get five feet on Coney Island, home of Nathan's Famous Hot Dogs, where they have now closed up shop at their boardwalk stand. Another place that could get inundated, the subway system. On a normal day, they have 280 pumping rooms going here, pushing out 13 million gallons of water. And now for Irene, they are bringing in a whole lot of extra pumping power. We have an enormous emergency shelter system and a database of thousands of city employees. The police department is positioning 50 small boats at station houses in low-lying areas. So the mayor has some big decisions hanging over him in the, ne in the coming hours. He has to decide whether to shut down the entire New York City subway system. He says he'll do that by tomorrow morning. Another decision, will he order a general evacuation of all those low-lying areas? That would be huge. A quarter of a million New Yorkers affected in George, I can imagine, knowing what I do about the city, that some of them would be a little annoyed. I think you're right about that. Hard to move that many people. Okay, Dan, thanks.